Okay, so I had a recent comment about Berry Boot not working uh, with the 8 gig Raspberry Pi 4. I haven't tried Berry Boot for a while because I've been using all my SSDs for other things. And uh, so I've reflashed Berry Boot onto my 4 gig uh, little tiny SD card. And let's plug it in and see what happens. Yeah, so it's coming up with an error. Now this has been updated with the, the latest firmware, um, so it supports USB boot, but it looks like uh, it doesn't support Berry boot. So I'm just going to try it with one of my older Pies and see if I can initiate it with that to see if that makes the difference. Okay, so let's plug in again. So the clear case is my 4 gig Pi, uh, but that's also got the latest kernel and the latest USB update and everything. Yeah, and that's booted fine. So there's obviously an issue with the 8 gig model not supporting it. Well, I wonder if I can set it up on the 4 gig model and then have it work on the 8 gig model. So my SSD is plugged in with my Dynamo adapter. Is that going to stand up? Okay, so select the destination drive. So it's going to be my 120 gig SSD and hit format. So it came up with an error, but I think that's all right um, because I'm pretty sure that happened before. Right, so let's put something tiny on here. So Puppy Linux is very small. Just to be able to test it, really. Press OK to reboot. Okay, so it's picked Puppy Linux, click OK on that. Yeah, and that's booted fine, so I need to switch that off. So let's shut that down. When we know that's off, we'll switch all the cables over There we go, so that's the four gig model and now I'm in the eight gig model. So let's plug it in. And hopefully it will boot. Oh, I haven't put the SD card in yet. One last thing to change. No, still doesn't work, so that's I don't quite know why that would be, but um, I could copy over all the 14 files for the boot, but it's not really, that's what the, not what they're for. They're for booting directly from USB. So if anybody else has had this, um, if you'd like to comment and, uh, and say if you've got a fix for it. I haven't tried pin OS yet, which is another way of getting uh, multiple systems on. So I guess I'm going to use Barry Boot with my 4 gig model in my fancy new very cheap case from Amazon which is a bit noisy, but actually I quite like it. It's quite solid and, uh, and it looks nice. Okay, so I hope this helps. Uh, I've just created a playlist for Berry Boot because I realized I've done 14 videos now on just on Berry Boot alone, uh, putting various different operating systems onto an SSD uh, and just how to do it. And uh, so if you need any help and how to install and if you want to see what other operating systems are there, just have a look through the playlist. It really is an excellent system and hopefully we can soon get this working with the 8GigPi. Okay, thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe.